So now we have our base, we're gonna make ourselves the pegs. So I'm gonna create a new document, create part studio. I'm gonna rename this to be um, uh, arm holder. And with this piece, it's gonna be a little more complicated. I'm gonna start off by making a, I'm gonna build this one piece at a time. So I'm gonna start off by starting a sketch on the top surface. I'm going to draw, I'm gonna look at my top surface. I'm gonna draw a circle. And then I'm going to take, and this surface is going to be revolved around this axis. So I need to make myself a line I can work around. So I'm gonna create a line and hit escape to end that line. And I'm gonna make this line what's called a construction line. So if I click on construction, it becomes dotted. He's not a real shape, he just lets me work off of that. So now I need to make my whole, the circle, dimension my circle. This circle is point O. Actually, we're gonna go look at what we used before. So I'm gonna go to the mousetrap body and I'm gonna go click on sketch two. And what I wanna do is sketch two, point O five three. So I'm going go here. And we're gonna mention this to be 053. The next step is we're gonna take and make sure this is horizontal to the axis. And I'm going to dimension from this edge to the edge of my circle. And that is going to be, going back to my master body, 0 0.014 divided by two. 0.14 divided by two, rather. So back to my arm holder. Point one four divided by two. This is locked down, it's all black. I can now take, go back to my isometric view, zoom way in, and I'm going to revolve this loop, no, this loop about this axis. And we wanna go 180 degrees. So we're gonna change it full, we're gonna pick an angle, one directional, and we're gonna go no, one direction and go 180. That gives me my half donut. I'm gonna fix this color while we're at it. We're gonna go double click on the colors picker. I'm gonna pick like a yellowish color. That looks good. Check. And now we're gonna take and close the color picker. And now we're going to extend the bottoms down. So now we're gonna take and start a sketch on the other surface. I'm gonna click on the use button. That's gonna let me project those two sketches and use them just like I drew them. So now I can take and extrude and we're gonna have to do a little math here. So we're gonna type the overall height of this hoop from the ground to the top of the hoop is 0.525. So 0.525. Two five minus point one uh point what is the we did for the monster body point one four divided by two so this is point five two five minus parentheses point one four slash two because I need to subtract out this internal space. And I also have to max subtract out minus the diameter, which is 0 0.053. And that should give me my good arm holder.